If you do go on to enjoy today's video, please consider liking it because I'm terrible at FIFA and I need all the self-esteem I can get. If you're interested in football shirts, football boots or anything football related, go check out my Depop. The link for that is also down below. And if you do need any coins, head over to u7buystore.com. Use the code TVM at checkout for a discount. The link is in the description. What is going on guys, TVM here. Welcome back to the Road to Glory. We don't have any gameplay today. Who cares about gameplay when you have 20 packs to open, right? Um, the other thing, of course, is we have Flashback Benzema. Am I doing it? I, I don't know, actually. Maybe. Um, we've got Baku to work towards. I will get him. Uh, might as well pick him up while doing some squad battles for potentially Silver Beats and for something else. I can't remember what I was working on. Uh, Team of the Week 10 is in packs. And, of course, that's not it. The Why, why would they not advertise that? The Signature Series... Uh, which they released yesterday, uh, today for me, incidentally. But that is also in packs, so there's plenty to open packs for right now. Quite excited, I won't lie to you. I would go through the like the worst packs first, but I, I mean, they're just all over the place. I'll try and find some of the dud packs. We'll skip through them as well. If this episode ends up being like five minutes long, so be it. If it ends up being really long, again, so be it. The League SBCs right now are on fire. Big, big fan of the way that they've done certain ones. Obviously, the Premier League is still class. Big fan of that. Uh, let's do that Electrum Players Pack. Uh, and I like the Sudamericana Libertadores ones as well. The Sudamericana is a little bit annoying because it can be expensive, but the Libertadores seems, seems to be quite reasonable the entire time. And I'm hoping just to keep packing those cards, and it would be typical now that I don't get any we want Premier League cards as well because we can rinse 50k packs. But um, yeah, big fan of it. I, this Road to Glory may end up turning into a pack to glory. Uh, you will see gameplay because I will play games every week in Division Rivals. But um, apart from maybe the, the 7 or 10 games that I play every week, maybe there won't be that much gameplay. I will be doing the objective players, so maybe I'll play. I'll show you some of the gameplay from that, unless it's squad battles, because I'm pretty sure no one wants to see that. But, um, rare mixed or small prime? Small prime mixed, because you're never going to get anything from a small prime mixed, are you? Are you? Haha, <laughs> moan it in. You get, you get your, um, get a board. It's going to be Marco Asensio, which is not fantastic, but still a board. Oh, two boards. And a Sudamericana card. You could not have asked for more if you tried. Uh, I want to really fill this club up with um, with content here because there's almost nothing in this in this club right now. All of these packs, apart from the 250Ks, all of them came from SBCs, whether they be league SBCs or... Oh, it's tradable. I was kind of hoping it was Mendy. Or... Um, Marquee matchups. I think UEFA marquee match matchups was in there as well. And maybe one or two lightning rounds here or there. Not lightning rounds. What are they called? The, like, Flash SBC or something. There's a Flash SBC there now, right? For a rare gold pack. Now, fair enough. I probably should have done it. But I literally had nothing left in my in my account. Um, it cost me, by the way, to get all these packs, it has essentially cost me 20k. Which I'm actually very happy with. So you might be thinking, well, you've done all the League SBCs. You haven't showed us. That's fine. But how much did you spend? 20k. Because I either had it already or it's just that cheap to complete the ones that I did. Three boards in a row. This is tradable again. It is going to be a Brozovic, another 84. Big fan of the 84s now and the 83s and such as well. Because it will allow us, or allow me, to do the 85+. plus, Which I think is pretty damn sexy. I did one yesterday. Uh, for 6 p.m. content and got Erling Haaland, which of course is not a special card, but he's an 88 rated card, which is much better than the 85 it could have been. So I'm very, very pleased. Now, if I really wanted to, I'm not going to, but if I really wanted to, I could put that Erling Haaland back into the 85 plus and make it substantially cheaper. Could be the way forward. Let's do the jumbo gold. Got a walkout from this one. Did I get Luis Suarez from one of these ones? Not on this occasion. Just looking for a, a, an inform or, or a special signature card of some description that would be very very nice it's been a little bit confusing uh the content from ea to be fair randomly announcing it throughout the day uh, and not really displaying it too uh too well in game such an ea thing to do uh small 
Prime Electrum. Let's do that. All of the tradable packs have, of course, come from... Uh, well, not they haven't come from League SBCs, but we're trying to make our money back through the tradable packs so that we can essentially say that, well, they didn't cost us anything because, like I said, I'm 20k down, but I've used all the players that I had in the club in order to do them for said league, and we kind of need to recoup some of that so we can put it back into bronze packs and put it back into the... Um, oh, it's an 81 plus here, so we could get a board. Uh, put, put it back into the league SBC system. We do get a board. It's English centre-back. It's going to be Harry Maguire... A lot of people might mean that, but to be fair, I'm all right with it because it's an 84. We get 83 Acardi in there as well. 84 Timo Werner at the end. And we can pop our one on the transfer list. Don't mind if I do. I was very tempted to put that Werner into the 85 plus that I did yesterday. And I, I stopped myself from doing it. But now I can. Uh, what have we got here? Small prime, small prime, small prime, small rear gold. Two of those, 250Ks, a mega pack. And a small prime electrum players pack. So this is the last of the worst packs, if you will. The rest of the packs are actually decent. We've had a lot of boards so far. So the luck is kind of with us. That's going to be Goosens, who we've packed already today. And I'm hoping this is tradable, right? It is. So we can pop him on the transfer list. Another Sudamericana card. And we can put that into the club. My cat is being an absolute div again. And going through plastic bags and making noise. So I do apologize. What do we have left? Should we do a small prime? So two of those are tradable. This is the untradable one. It is an 80 plus. Decent chance of getting a little board. No, not on this occasion. To be fair, if I'm going to get a good card, I would like it to be tradable anyway. So we'll pop that into the club. Hope that this is a tradable duplicate. It is indeed. We can save it. All of the cards, they'll go in like 81 pluses or something like that. Or we just sell them or put them into league SBCs. So I'd rather just keep everything I can right now. 50k, mega pack 50k. 25Ks, and then, yeah, so let's do the 15K pack. No, this isn't the 15K. This is a Jumbo Premium Players pack. It's a board again. Why can't it be something decent? It's going to be Gosens one more time. Is this tradable? Because I might have to discard an 83. I'm not going to be, like, sat here rinsing cards because I don't want to... Yeah, I'm going to have to discard him. I may recover him if I need an 83. To be fair, I might have to do this. I might have to discard a lot of cards here. That's a shame, because that is a decent amount of coins, because they are worth a little bit, to be fair. But, um, yeah, I can keep Kondogbia, but I've got to get rid of the rest of them. So, that's a shame. Could I have done an SBC just now? Yes, I could have. I'm not that frugal. I'm not that bothered, to be honest. If uh, It is what it is, right? Small Prime Gold Players Pack. Come on, we're into the good packs now. We need to be packing something. I just want one of the best of Team of the Week or a signature card. And I, and I know I sound like a little bit spoiled saying all I want, but I only want one, even if it's the worst one. I'm trying to think of the worst one from the Signature series. That's what I'm going to call it. I don't know if it's called the Signature series, but I can't think of the worst one. The the Dutch League guy. Is there a Dutch League guy? I can't remember. Save Gonlons. Plenty of room on the transfer list. Don't need to worry about it. Six packs remain. Flown through these quite quickly, actually, but... Two of them, three of them are quite good. Uh, let's do the 25k. I would have kept that half of 100k or whatever it is if I would read it properly. I always read it as a 15k pack because you just see premium and then you see jumbo or whatever. And you're like, oh, it's a 15k pack. Just didn't read it properly. Now we're into the nitty gritty. We're into five packs. Uh, to be fair, they're all pretty decent, but these two are untradeable. Kevin De Bruyne. Or Ben Yedda, please. Nope. Board, though. Uh, Portugal. Ronaldo. No. It's um, 84 Andre Silva, who I do have as a ones to watch, actually. But all that can go into the club. I like it. I'm nervous now. I've been, like, I've been waiting since yesterday afternoon, or two days ago, for you guys to open this. And I've been, yeah, you wait and you think, oh, the anticipation's good. I, I, I'm, I'm bound to get something. I've got so many packs. Now that we're down to the last two or three, <laughs> oh dear, I should never have opened them. At least the, the, the promise would have been there. 283s again, going to be able to do one of these 85s quite comfortably. Probably save it for the next episode though, because we do have some big boy packs here. 83 guaranteed, nothing guaranteed in the 50k. Let's do the mega pack. There is a guarantee in a tradable mega pack, but there's not in a tradable 50k. It's another board. I mean, we're getting boards for days. 
but we want to walk out EA. Alexandro, 83. Um, nothing else in there, really. Some Premier League players, to be fair, which is nothing to be sniffed at with uh, how good the the Premier League SBC is. You can't search for them on the market. Could be 5K, could be 4K, I don't know. Uh, I will discard him, even though I could probably get a little bit out of him, but it's just effort at this point. And 250Ks. 250Ks. Let's do the tradable one first, because even though I want to pack something really good tradable to give us coins, it's a walkout. Can't be anything decent, though, can it? It could be Frankie de Jong, 87 rated. I don't think he's worth anything anymore. The reason I've kept the untradable one is because it's guaranteed an 83. So at least we're guaranteed a board. You're not guaranteed anything in this 50k. We did get a walkout though. Probably our best pack of the day. And Frankie de Jong is worth the rating that he is printed on. He's worth about 20,000 coins. I will keep him in the club for now. Decent little Libertadores card to get. We can pop all those on the transfer list. And it comes down to this. Mamma mia. Um, 83 guaranteed. Not going to mess around. We're just going to get it open. Please. Give me a walkout. It's not. It's a board. <sighs> Why? It's going to be um, Zapata as well. It is... It's just so disappointing when you've got all those packs stacked. Loads of boards, to be fair. I genuinely thought that 85 plus was repeatable. I don't know why, because if you think about it, it's a little bit overpowered for it to be repeatable. But, yeah, I went to do one, and I've already done it, obviously, because I got early in Holland, so I'm a little bit disappointed by that. Could have done maybe an 81 plus double. What do you need for this? Um, 50 chem, just rare gold cards. Is it wise for me to do this? Probably not. I'll do one of these, and I've got a rare Electrum. I'm going to try and use players I don't really care about. So I won't use the leagues that I'm concentrated on, shall we say. But um, certain leagues I'm just not bothered by. To be fair, if it's a Premier League card, I won't use it any other league. I'll just get it gone, especially the Dutch league, because that's something I, I probably never intend on doing. So can I get the chemistry? What do we need? 50 chem? Just sort this out a little bit here. Uh, I'll put him at left back actually 41 chem quite close but not quite not gonna get it am i um what do i need maybe another dutch league card and we could be good to go so david nares might be what we need we'll keep looking just in case there's one more there there isn't really if we're honest we might just might as well take him because he's a, an actual center back i think i need um yeah, I think I was going to say, I think I need all rears. That's not going to give me the chem. Why am I so bad at doing SBCs on the fly? That gives me four chem. I just need two chemistry, EA. Just give me two chemistry. EA, man. Two chem. Two chem. That's one chem. I need... There's two chem. There we go. Jeez, that was difficult. That was hard work. I don't like doing that. Let's never do that again. Um, just want a, a signature card, really. That's all I really want. Just to say, hey, look, I packed one. To be fair, I, I've got plenty of time to get these. There's plenty of, of ways to get them in or through League SBCs. So I'm not too concerned just yet. Uh, we're not approaching the hour mark, so there's not going to be a lightning round. Let's do the rare Electrum. Oh, no. I don't even think I've used these. I said to myself, use Bale and Livakovic, and then because the 85 plus wasn't repeatable, I was so confused I've completely forgotten. So we're, we're just going to discard them. Uh, Rear Electrum, guaranteed an 82. Can this be the pack? No. Uh, are they in packs? Uh, anyone? 84 Ginter, which is decent. Stock in the club up with 84s and 85s as well. Maybe not 85s, but 84s and 83s now, which is nice. But nothing for me really to use them on. I could go and get Karim Benzema, but I don't really think, for God's sake, I don't really think he would benefit me. You know, I'd enjoy it for like five minutes and then I'd probably come up with an excuse as to why I don't like it. And finally, to end today's packathon, next episode there will be gameplay. Uh, I don't know when it'll be. It might not even be until Thursday, but if I can make enough packs by tomorrow or the day after or the day after i will start doing them but i'm only really going to be doing road to glories when i've either got plenty of gameplay 
or loads of packs or there's a big change to what I'm doing with regards to the team or whatever it may be. Maybe I've unlocked loads of things. But um, yeah, there definitely won't be daily Road to Glories. But this is going to be the last action for today. Can an 81 plus double be our saviour? Guess who it is? It's Erlin Holland. Now, don't get me wrong. Chuffed. But I got him like, I don't know, 15, 16 minutes ago. Maybe a little bit more than that. Um, I'm going to have to do a big-ish SBC to get rid of him. Could there be maybe an 85, 86 hanging behind? 82. So I've packed him twice in the space of 20 minutes. I'm going to have to find an SBC to put him into. Not quite sure yet which one. Leave your suggestions down below. Maybe I'll do one and do a review on him. It could be Benzema. Not sure. If you have enjoyed this episode of The Road to Glory, hit the like button, subscribe to the channel for new, and until the next time, goodbye.